Weather with Stephanie Mead. Mild day across most of the area and we'll continue to see temperatures well around average going into the start of your work week. So let's take a look at our temperature trends starting off Monday 59, but then we're in the 60s Tuesday and then we're flirting with 70 by the end of the week and going into your weekend 72. So nice weather ahead of us as well as plenty of sunshine. So mostly a spring like week ahead of most of northeastern Wisconsin. As of right now, temperatures are in the mid to lower 40s. Green Bay, it's 46 right now. Out towards Kiwani, 43. To head in more towards inland Appleton at 46 degrees. We are, however, in for a cooler night tonight as temperatures will drop into the mid to lower 30s. And we did see quite a bit of sunshine today, but skies are going to clear out and we'll see mostly clear skies going into your evening tonight. Here on Precision Radar, we haven't seen too much activity over the day. Just mostly sunny skies, maybe a couple of high clouds passing through. But however, we are in store for a bit of a change. We have a system that's just off towards the west. It's a cold front. And associated with that, we have some rain showers, but none of that will hit us. We only are going to see temperatures get knocked by a couple of degrees by midweek. And here on satellite and radar, the cold front right now is just off into the plains. Low, front, low pressure will move its way in. However, we do have a high pressure system in place right now, so it's clearing out a lot of cloud cover. And it's keeping us relatively dry and giving us plenty of sunshine today and over the next couple of days. So planning out the next couple of days here in Green Bay going into Monday, future or precision caster, however, we'll see mostly to partly sunny skies. Green Bay, mostly sunny, and then out towards the lake, mostly sunny skies as well. And then going into Tuesday, very similar setup with mostly sunny skies, maybe a couple of high clouds passing through, but our weather is staying relatively calm over the next couple of days. And we'll see that temperature wise as well. Around average for this time of year going into tomorrow, mid to upper 50. Some areas might even be flirting with 60 degrees. And then going into Tuesday, very similar setup, maybe a touch warmer with temperatures in the mid to lower 60s in Green Bay out towards the lake. We'll see mid to lower 50s, but overall, nice mild day over the next couple of days temperature wise. However, for tonight, chilly conditions in the mid to lower 30s, mostly clear skies, winds staying relatively calm out of the northeast between 5 to 10 miles per hour. Going into tomorrow, temperatures rising back up into the mid to upper 50s. Some areas flirting with 60 degrees with mostly sunny skies. Mild, breezy conditions at times with winds of the northeast between 5 to 15 miles per hour. Going into the rest of your work week, Tuesday 64, 61 on Wednesday. Mostly sunny skies continuing on into Thursday, high of 62. And then by the end of your week, 70s. And then we see a slight chance of some showers, maybe even thunderstorms making their way in by the end of your weekend and into early next week, but we do continue to see 70s Monday into Tuesday with mostly sunny skies by the middle of next week. So this week is looking nice and mild and temperatures should be around average, but by the end of the week above normal. That's good because for a long time I feel like we've been hanging out below normal. So yes. it's time we got back up to speed. Exactly. All right. Thanks, Stephanie. In tonight's Mino project, the Czech Republic will be celebrating the 70th anniversary of their liberation from the Nazis this week. And this year, they're bringing back members of the American troops that freed them, including a Shano man who's looking to reunite with some old friends. It's a story you'll see only on 